Hello friends, uh, this is Dr. R. B. Kusoha, Assistant Professor in the Division of Veterinary Clinical Complex, FVSC and AH at ISCOS, Jammu. Welcome to my YouTube channel and if you have not subscribed the, my channel, so kindly subscribe the channel and hit the bell icon for the further notification. So today uh, we have a case of the traumatic pericarditis in a adult cow. So the history of uh, this cow uh, is uh, this cow is not taking anything from the last seven days and the condition of this cow is deteriorating day by day. Right now uh, you could see here, so there is a distension of the jugular vein, this one and there is a brisket edema. So you could see this is the brisket edema and this is the jugular vein it is the engorge. So engorge jugular vein and the brisket edema it is a common clinical sign of the traumatic pericarditis and the owner also told that the milk production decreases drastically. So we took the radiograph, a foreign body is visible in the radiograph and we also performed the ultrasonography. So we approach from the both right side and the left side. So we found that the on ultrasonography the fluid level towards the left side is much more as compared to the right side. So uh, we decided that it is better to do the pericardiosynthesis via left side. So for doing this uh, pericardiosynthesis we sedated this animal by the combination of xylazine, butorphenol and the ketamine mixture in the 1 is to 2 is to 3 ratio. So we are given uh, intravenously 2 ml the mixture of the 3 injection and then we desensitize this area by the infiltration of the 7 to 8 ml lignocaine anesthetic solution and then uh, taking the aseptic precaution we have inserted this spinal needle from the fifth intercostal space. So now you could see this is the flow of the this putrefying uh, fluid from the this pericardial space. So already uh, about uh, 400 ml fluid already drained you could see on the ground. So this is all fluid drained. So you could see, so level is decreases that is why now it is coming drop by drop otherwise initially it was coming, uh, now it is coming, yeah, this one. So definitely if you perform the pericardiosynthesis, so it decreases the pressure over the heart and the, this venous congestion decreases, so uh, there is a relief up to certain extent. So our plan is to after this we perform the rhumatotomy to remove the foreign body and then put on the antibiotic. So, so this is the how you can perform the pericardiosynthesis and if you like this video so kindly share with your friends and subscribe the channel if you have not subscribed yet. So thank you very much.